In this video, we are going to take a look at how to access PubMed via UAH's Salmon Library, as well as highlight some key points concerning how this resource works. PubMed is a free resource that is developed and maintained by the National Center for Biotechnology Information via the U.S. National Library of Medicine. It is a database that includes over 23 million references for biomedical literature. PubMed citations and abstracts include the fields of medicine, nursing, dentistry, veterinary medicine, the healthcare system, and preclinical sciences. PubMed is a citation and abstract database. This means it does not actually host the full text on PubMed. While it does supply some external linking to where the full text of a document is located, you won't be certain of your privileges to actually access this content. However, you can improve your experience by going directly through the Salmon Library website to gain access to the full text articles that UAH has licensed for you. To navigate to PubMed, first go to the library homepage at uah.edu library. Once there, click on the Articles and Databases tile. Then, select the Nursing button in the blue sidebar on the left. You'll find PubMed listed here among the other relevant nursing resources. You can also select the Science button to find it listed under Biology and Chemistry Resources. This is the default PubMed interface where you can execute basic or advanced searches. Let's say we are looking for resources on the topic of chemical peeling. If I search for these terms, I'll get a result list of records containing abstracts for related materials. Once we click on one of these records, you'll see why going through the library interface is so important. This article, for example, tells us full text can be found through publisher Elsevier. It looks like UAH doesn't have access to the particular journal this article is found in, and I'll show you why in just a moment. Clicking on this link that says Elsevier will only offer us an option to purchase the article, which we do not want to do. If you really wanted this content, we could attempt to obtain a copy via our interlibrary loan service, so check with the librarian first. Also, take note that if you had gone to PubMed's website directly, Rather than through the library portal, as we have just done, you would still see an option to purchase the article even if we at UAH did have the content. So, how do we help? Well, going back to our result list, let's select another article. You'll see an example here on the right under the full text links option saying ACS publications and find at UAH. Here, we have access to an article published in an American Chemical Society title. The Find at UAH blue icon is the giveaway here, indicating that Salmon Library provides access to this content via the American Chemical Society website. Clicking on either of these buttons will take you to the full text. If you had searched PubMed by going directly to their site via a Google search, you would have gotten the same record with just one link present for the American Chemical Society, and you would not be recognized as having the rights to access the full text. So remember, go through Salmon Library's established guides. Doing so will save you time, as well as make you a more efficient researcher. If you ever need further assistance, contact one of your librarians. We're here to help.